When I look back at 2013 and I think of the fact that we won the National Criterium Calendar, that we won the USA Criteriums, but we also won the USA America Tour. Looking back at a 2013 season like that, with as many wins as we did, I can't think of a team in the past 10 or 20 years that's had that kind of record. The first race of the series started in Tucson in Arizona. You know, a few new guys, Carlos Elzate was new, Luke Keogh was new, but you know, we really had a goal this year that we felt through training camp, we really spoke up and thought, you know, we could almost win every criterium we start. In building the 2013 criterium team, when we started thinking about how to win race after race, we focused on making sure we had enough speed, but also riders that had enough power to deliver that speed. This winter time, I spend quite a bit of time at the wind tunnel. Most people go to the wind tunnel and think about time trial positioning. But I went there looking at the wheels, the way that they interact with one another, the way they interact with our frame, and the way that a speed suit or a specific piece of clothing works in a road position, not just in a time trial position. And that's where we came up with the best package for the athletes to wear to be as efficient as possible. With one race to go, we're sitting on 31 out of 33 that I've started this year and we lost two races. And the guys have been so focused and you know, some people have thought it's been like clockwork, but you know, to, to keep this focus through the whole series has been amazing. What we never did was taking winning for granted. We focused every single race on perfection. After every race, we had a meeting, even if we won the race, even if we swept the podium. We met time after time and discussed where we made mistakes, where we could have ridden better, what were things that we needed to improve on, and each individual rider's strengths and weaknesses. And, you know, leading into this, the second last race of the NCC Four at leader. Las Vegas, Four racing leader. in Mandalay yeah, Bay. Vegas. Ladies and gentlemen, hails from got nice tyres, it's really slick in this car park. A lot of our competition sort of, we've, we've been winning so much that they, they can't figure it out right now, but the guys really adapt to, to everything that's thrown at them. We've had so many scenarios thrown at us and the guys keep coming out with the goods. So it's just been a, it's been a great experience to be part of this. For sure the bar has been set high for 2014, but we'll find a way to excel and look beyond it. We'll find a way to push uh, the boundaries a bit further.